Ready? Yeah. Ready to go? Yeah. Let's do it. All right. Uh, when I hit the face, I'll tell you. No idea. Guys, big day today. We're out on the beautiful Juno Look Resort. We're playing the lake today. Of course, we've not played in a while, we're saying, Tommy. June's had a lot of action recently. Quarry's had a lot of action, but Lake, I mean, I can't remember the last time we played this. So we're starting with the Cobra King Tour. Four holes with this before we move on to a combo set of CB and MBs, baby. That, ladies and gentlemen, is the new tour. Unfortunately, I've just taken the wrapper off and my next shot is gonna be on the beach. You can't win them all. Oh, this is a funky lie as well. Got to catch it clean. Got to catch them all. It was a half and half. Ah, bit heavy. You can ask me what they feel like, aren't you? you still, go. still don't know. Now we've bo bottom groove and then sand between ball. Next shot. Yeah, we'll get there. Been a bit of a mess. But this is what the problem you see when you play this nine at length. It's a very different golf course. Oh, I like that. I like that. It's zippy, zippy, that is. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Doc, I love you, mate. Thanks mate, I fell in love with that. Just what, I, just what I really needed right now. Do you know what, come on tour with me. No, you're right, you're right. This is... Uh... <laughs> What's that, huh? <laughs> mate, that's some four. Jeez. The, the bit I really enjoy in a video is asking the graphic designer what he thinks of the looks. I think it looks good. <laughs> Lol. Clean? It's on the edge. Like it's, it's just clean. Like it's almost too much. Do you think so? Yeah, a lot of lines. Yeah. Very liney, isn't it? This this bit here. Mm -hmm. It's a bit like, um, have you seen Simon Cowell's eyebrows? His eyebrows like go over. Like the rock. <laughs> <laughs> like Tommy's just doing this right now. <laughs> do you know what um, I do like? I mean, obviously this is like I say, it's a tall head. It's, it's a better player's iron. And I like that you can sneakily see it at the back look. I don't know why I do like seeing that. You see, you've got a nice little sharp, sharp, thinnish top line. And then you can just see a little bit, bit, a bit of the cavity at the back, which it's crazy how much of a difference that makes. It really is. Let's go. Not a stinger. Man, the swing feels terrible this morning. <laughs> oh, there's no control over that. It worked well for me, but. So how, how does that feel? Oh, no, it, it, I struck it. I struck it, but it wasn't the shot I wanted. Um, sounds beautiful. You think I sounded well? Yeah. Really, really nice. My opinions on these sort of irons. Um, remember when Tylist and Cobra were together, it cushioned it, um, made great irons and then it, they went on their own, went very youthful, a lot of colour and now I feel like they've dialed it back a little bit to be more, it's a very sensible iron. Do you know what I mean by that? Like I'm not, they used to have oranges and stuff on it still, even the player's stuff and now it's like, it's very very sleek and fancy. It is, big fan. Oh no. The worst rule in golf. No, not fixing your divots. I've got to play that. I've got to play in someone's crater. Centre of the fairway. I'd rather be in that crap over there. 
Yeah, I should just be able to roll it backwards, but <clears throat> no, mate. No. It came all about whether you got your hat backwards or not. You know what? Oh, mate, this is not good. Do you want me to talk you through this? There you go. Yeah, I don't think that would have stopped much. Really, there was a bit. In hindsight, if you were playing a, an event, your caddy would have gone, well, this all feeds to the pin. You could have tried to land it here and it will do the rest for you, especially having no spin. But there's Al going guns blazing at the flag. <laughs> it's got to be left to right, but it's one of those where I don't know if it actually is. It's got to be left to right, which one of those where it might not be. <laughs> did that even move? Huh? That does not look straight. That does not look like a straight putt. Also, it, it's growing on me. Yeah, I don't, that, I, 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 I don't want to like. <laughs> Do, 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 ca, ca, I, I wasn't going to say oh, I was going to say that, but it is. I think when you really focus on all the lines, it's quite a lot. But when you look at it as a whole, it's not. Um, body, 1025C forged construction, multi-material. This whole iron. We will be going into more detail with this in the net. This is more of a playability. Oh, not that word. So playability is what we call a PGA. So you have to do you have a playability test. If you ever mention playability now to anybody, it's like. Ugh. This test is this course vlog is more to do with obviously performance on the golf course. Very important. It's all right hitting shots at the net, dry ball data, no grass or interaction. This is out here. Seeing how the ball flies. IRL. Young kids will love that one. An overall performance in different situations. So here we are. Right. The time is half past eight. We've just finished the second hole. We've got to give this cart back by ten o'clock. So it's a bit of a race against time. We're going to do nine holes. It should be fine, but with B-roll and everything, it's not like we're just playing the nine holes. We've got to get little shots in and things like that. So we've got a bit of a race on our hands. To make it even better, this is the last time we're going to film until January when Tommy comes back from the UK. So not only do we need to get this done, <laughs> we've got a time limit. <laughs> um, so yeah. Ooh. I like the pitching wedge. That's some size, that is. I do like that. And that straight away tells you that, yes, it's targeting. I'm sure Cabra okay, put this as a mid to low handicapper. It's still very much, you know, you might be a low handicapper, but you might need the, uh, the, the forgiveness as well. And you can tell it with this compared to the CBMB. Definitely tells the story. We've got 100, oh, 153 meters. I've got pitching wedge. It's a big pitching wedge. The cart's too far away to change now miles away i'd have to set off now and i'll be there tomorrow i think of all the irons in this range this is the one that could probably make a hundred and that's miles isn't it that's not even yards do i do it do i go i've hit that heavy No, it's short, but it would have. I reckon that's got a right chance. That was. It did. I, I, I did a little ground before ball again. Don't know what's going off. I know. I, I know. I do know what's going off. That's what's going off. Do I chip this, Tommy, or do I put this? Your choice. Um, I say chip. Oh God. Do, right. When I say that, say put. <laughs> Right, well, it was going to be potentially be a par. Now double bogeys on the on the on the cards. Got to be left to right, right right edge of the bunker, the background, dark patch. Easy petal, easy, easy now. That's terrible. Oh my, Tommy. Sure fault, mate. Hold it. 
Tommy? How you have you struggled to sleep tonight? I hope you swallow one of the five spiders on average that you swallow in a, in a, in a, in a, in a year tonight. It's a big one. Behind the hitting area, there's also a medallion aluminium or aluminium, if you're in the US, co-mold with that paired with a TPU insert, which sits directly behind the hitting area. Medallion is better. That's a quite a tongue twister. No, medallion aluminium co-mold. Not medallion. It's not Wingardium Leviosa. It's Leviosa. <laughs> <laughs> no, Tom, you're doing it wrong. <laughs> It's medallion aluminium, not al aluminium aluminium. I've had one coffee today. Yeah, one. And again, with this being a player range, you could expect, well, we haven't got really jacked lofts. So with the tour set, we've got 32 degrees in the 7 iron. This is an 8, but 7 iron. Imagine this was a 7 iron, this would be 32 degrees. The 7 iron's here, actually, I'll show you. 7 iron. Wrapper. Welcome, everyone, to the on course shot shaping challenge so we usually do this in the net but i wanted to see this with shot tracers these are players irons they are required to move the ball we need ball maneuverability we're going to play three balls we're going to start with the first ball which we're going to continue the round with but then we're going to play uh, normal ball is going to be straight left of the bunkers we're going to play a fade and we're also going to play a draw with the third ball so let's get going first ball Four iron in hand, relatively straight, I think. What about a low flight, Tommy? Do you want low or high? It's not low. Yeah, it was nice. It popped up a little bit again, but I'm hitting quite low on the face. F uh, fade first or draw? Right, we're gonna have to. I want these to all be playable. So draw from that bu bunker. Oh, baby. It's a soft draw, and that wind's bringing it back, but that's a draw. Okay. Now the, now the test. Left side of the fairway. Let's move this left to right. Yeah, it's a lovely little muted. Look at a little, yeah, it's like a, it's like a silencer on it, don't you think? Like a little beautiful whistle. Oh, Tommy. Yes, is the answer. Even a dummy can uh, shot shape. Welcome guys to Natural World. And I think this is a, an animal that we've, we've never done before on, on Natural World, actually. Which is quite remarkable because they're everywhere. The little Jerry, look, look at him. No, we're all right, mate. Hello, hello, hello. So dispersion. <laughs> the straight one, which was a bit of a bit, bit of chunkitis in the hands. That's the draw, and that's I think the fade. I mean, I did well to draw and get there. To be honest, you'd have thought that'd be the draw, but no, no, not in my world. Right, we're continuing with this ball. I feel like that, do you know uh, Independence Day when they, they, spoiler alert, when they crash the alien ship and they, they, they slow my walk in the desert? That's what I felt like when you were picking me up. Just save the world, that was a great four iron. <laughs> I told you I was going for you. <laughs> No, it, that was the best strike, and that sounded unbelievable. <laughs> it was like, well done, Al. It, it literally went, well done, Al. Do you realize, really, that's gone a lot further than what I thought. I, I was gonna say, like, just after this white mark with that wind, you can feel it now. Yeah. It was just, oh, mate, munched. Chance to get this back to level before we switch to the CBMB, hey? Calls for a bit of a flopperdopolis, this one does. Do you wanna see you flop? Or do you want a, do you want a guaranteed birdie, Tommy? Well, guaranteed birdie. <laughs> really? It still requires a bit of a flop. I'm not going to lie to you. It's not. An, if I hit this bank, I've screwed it. I've got to fly it. Oh, 
I didn't fly it. Great shot. My idea is not the legs. See, that's a hard shot. I think we pitched it here, it landed here, and then just tracked on. But if you could land it here with a bit more, a bit softer, it would have uh, trickled down. <coughs> so, Tommy just asks, it looks like it's a lot more break from here. And the problem is, when you're a right-handed putter, every putt's difficult for me, but when it comes away from you, it's hard to commit the stroke, almost like you feel like you're exiting left. I've got to trust this now. What I've started to do is just line it up, almost ignore where the, ho ignore where the hole is, and just follow on that line. And it's gonna come back in, if you don't race it past. <sighs> I was gonna say, one over, but this is probably not gonna go in. Oh, it is, yay! One over, first four. We've got five remaining in the next video with the CVMB combo, a combo I'm very excited about. But tour again, like I say, it's, a, it's almost like a first impressions this has been. This is before the net video. Um, again, not much wrong with it, is there? No. It did everything it said it would. It's full of tech. It's packed into a player's shape. It looks good. Played all right with them. Except for that pitch that Tommy made me do. That little chip instead of putting it, but that's not my fault, that's Tommy's fault. It's not Cobra's fault either, that's also Tommy's fault. So, great iron, go tour. Now for the CBMB, what can these produce in the next five holes? Follow me. Guys, thanks as always for watching. If you're not a part of Team Al, hit the subscribe button, the bell notification, follow us on social media, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and I'm live streaming on Twitch. See you in part two, five under. Oh yeah, look at this Tommy, Tommy, you would do anything for this channel wouldn't you? Yeah guys, we're going to have to hit again.